Welcome back, inmates, to Star Wars The Old Republic, and our smuggler, one Mr. Ronhar Allos. So, this is going to be interesting. We're still on the tail of Skavik in our ship. So we're still on Ord Mantel. Uh, there's, there's, a lot, there's a lot happening. There's a lot happening. We're going to pick up this side quest. Those levels. I want to hit 80 as soon as possible so I can focus maybe less on doing side quests and more on story stuff. I'll see how I feel about that still. Please, I'm I, I'm at the end of my rope. Oh, soldiers, hi there. Soldiers beat me, took my belongings, my daughter. You know what? Like I said before, we're a smuggler, but we're a smuggler with a heart of gold. They were criminals, not good soldiers. Then help me. Don't turn uh, a blind eye, like like the rest. Please help. My, my daughter means everything to me. Help me get my daughter back. Help. I, mean, I, don't, I don't understand why soldiers would take your daughter. Where would they take her? I, I don't know. There's, there's been... There's been a string of abductions lately. But I never thought they'd take her. I, I, I never thought they'd take my... Coel. They... They were headed toward the fort. Please. Please find my daughter. I'll see this through. I promise. Please. Hurry, I, I, I want to see my daughter again. Damn, the soldiers really are not messing around, are they? Alright, let's go meet Trimbo. Right house. You must be here for my husband. I told Master Vidu he's gone out fishing. Would you like a sweet flat cake instead? It's fresh. This whole place is crawling with separatists. What's Trimbo doing out fishing? Catching dinner, I hope. We're making Aqualish medley. If you don't feel like waiting for Trimbo, the walk out to him is lovely. The beach is so relaxing. Trimbo's at his fishing camp. He'll be thrilled to have some company. And now, excuse me, dearie. These rhodian peppers won't cook themselves. I have so many questions about this. Like, for me, that is completely new and different. Oh, wow, that's all the way up there. Oh, there is no fast travel point. Oh, well, it's fine. Because we now have a car! Fuck yeah. Go off. So for anyone wondering, you can still find codes for this game or stuff that you can redeem. And this was actually one of the ones that I was able to redeem. I don't remember the website, but if you really want me to, I can go look for it. So if you have an interest in the codes for some things, let me know. I can track them down and I can like post them in my Discord or something. Well, let's just unlock this. In a doofus, which is kind of normal at this point. Oh, this does not seem like a good place to fish. Just putting that out there. Is he up there? No, he's in here. Don't, don't stand there. That spot is reserved exclusively for my Gundark friends. You're clearly not a Gundark. Your ears are too small. Listen, do you smell that? There's a pot of Alderanian stew bubbling. But how could I smell it all the way on Ord Mantel? Vido sent me to pick up a canister of chemicals from you. What's a Vidu? Some kind of musical instrument? Is, is is that what keeps playing that awful tune I can't get out of my head? Hmm. I do recall a man saying to expect a stranger coming for my chemicals. You seem pretty strange. Was he talking about you? You've inhaled a lot of chemicals, haven't you? Did my wife tell you that? She's been dead 20 years now. Don't <laughs> listen to what? her. 
People haven't had much luck getting my chemicals. Know why? Those Ugnot assassins in the woods attack everyone who visits me. Ugnot assassins? Don't you mean separatists? Who do you really think controls the separatists? Those crafty little swine, that's who. But we can beat them. What you really need is a precision teleporter, but a former assistant crashed my prototype into the sun. Good luck, my friend. If you should explode, please feel free to come back and tell me all about it. Everyone else has. I think this man is a few candles short of a blaze. God damn. <laughs> okay. I actually don't know what to make of that, uh, that entire exchange. That was... <laughs> okay. Fishing my ass. <laughs> uh. Right, so we have a few things we can do here. And one of them is helping that old man with his daughter. Because... That shit is not something to be done. Also, we have the ethics officer that we need to go speak to. To report those guys for their dumb shit with the refugees in the crates. Instead of just sending them to do mines, why not just fucking ration this stuff and give it out to people? Come on, man. Alright, let's see what this guy has to say. Come on, get in here on the double. We don't have all day. <gasps> I already told you. I don't know anything. I swear. Sure, that's what you said last time we talked. But now I'm thinking maybe you just didn't have enough incentive to tell the truth. Hey, what are you doing here? You're not allowed in here. This is a top secret operation. Somebody want to explain what's going on? None of your business, buddy. Move along. He's lying. They've kidnapped us. They're torturing us. Shut up! Ugh. Please, you have to stop them. They're torturing us. I said shut up! She's a traitor to the Republic. She deserves what she gets. But the courts are full, you see, and so justice needs a little help. If that means Republic soldiers have to twist a few arms, so be it. You sure about that? These wretches have been caught, every last one of them, doing work for the Separatists. They are traitors, and more importantly, they have information on Separatist movements. All we're doing is coaxing it out of them. Information that will save so many Republican Mantellian lives. Who'll care how we got it? I'll care, and I'll make sure your superior cares too. Look, we don't like having to do this, but what are our choices? Listen. You take this ring back to this girl's daddy and tell him it's all you could find of his little girl. The ring's got a listening device in it. We'll be able to gather all the evidence we need without resorting to these unsavory means. Got it? And thus you're actually just pushing the guy towards the separatist because then he's going to look for their help in dealing with you? You really are not a smart guy, are you? This charade of justice ends <laughs> now. Whoa, whoa, take it easy. The last thing we need in here is a shootout, all right? What the little traitor so bad, fine, take her. The only people you're helping are the Separatists. Thank you. Thank you for freeing me. It... it was terrible. I wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy. It seems like it's nothing but corruption on Ord Mantell these days. Good to see you're an exception. I'm glad I was around to help out. And I'm just glad you were here. Thank you so much. Now, if I remember things from the trooper side, they went to one meeting. One meeting. Just to see what it was all about. And that's why they were captured. Because they were more curious than they were actually actively going to join them. In the end, sorry to say it, but that Republic soldier might have caused them to actually join the Separatists. If the, we had gone the other route. This guy, I think. There he is. Oh, great. Let me guess. Ethics violation? 
bad people doing bad things and it made you sad? Every day the same scrag, day in, day out. Why me? Aren't you the ethics officer? Right. So that means I have to be the moral compass for an entire army of degenerates? Bad. Pretty much, yes. So what do you want? Do you have any idea what the soldiers have found to bet on? You mean the minefield run, don't you? With those wretched refugees. That minefield game has been shut down for months. I made sure of that personally. You sure about that? You're completely sure now? Look, look, I'm sure. I'd even go and check it out for you, except there are reports of dangerous explosions in the area. Oh. Blast it. Those... I I'll take care of this. Don't you worry. Here. Uh -huh. There's a uh, standing reward of credits for squealers. I mean, <laughs> I mean information gatherers. This planet needs serious help. You don't know the half of it. At this point, the planet needs more help from the Republic than the Separatists. Or help from both at this stage. Alright. Let's get back to Vidu, then we're gonna go drop off that quest completion at Orida. Easy does it. I've got a storage unit here to stabilize the canister so it doesn't blow. There we go. That's something you'll want to handle real careful like. Don't worry. This canister's safer than a senator's daughter in a room full of Jedi. Getting Trimbo's chemicals saved our necks, Captain. Rogan will be too busy selling them to think about the blasters. The Separatists sure seemed interested in getting that canister. Maybe we should let them have some. They might blow themselves up. I've got good news and great news, Captain. We cracked the Separatist computer files and found Skavik. Vidu. You promised you wouldn't get so excited. It isn't good for your heart. Sorry, sweetheart, but this is going to be great! Skavik won't even see us coming! Ha! Does Skavik still have my starship? Your ship and the blasters. Great, huh? We'll get back everything he stole all at once. Skavik is taking the blasters to the Separatist base. Those wackos built their headquarters inside an old volcano. Crazy, huh? What do you expect from foaming at the mouth murderers? I wish that volcano would blow its top. Skavik's delivering the blasters to a psycho named Darig at the base. You need to get there first. When Skavik shows up, you can ambush him, grab your ship, and fly back here. Easy, huh? Easy isn't the first word that comes to mind. Well, what if I sent along a little help? Take Corso with you, Captain. The kid knows more about blasters and vibroblades than anybody I've ever met. I owe Skavik payback for taking Torchy. That was lower than low. It'll be nice to have some backup out there. <laughs> Glad you think so. Then it's a deal. You two head for the Separatist base, kill Darig, and ambush Skavik when he shows up. I've got a bottle of Chandralin brandy to open when you get back. Consider me signed on. I'd wish you two good luck, but I don't want to jinx anything. Just come back in one piece. Mm. All right. Oh, I forgot about these. You know, I actually kind of like Corsa's original look, but we'll take that one if we do decide to change it. And now we have a buddy. There is a difference with this buddy. We can either set him to be a damage dealer, a tank, or a healer, and we're going to stick with him as a healer. Because why not? All right, next stop, Ardem. Oh shit, yeah, I forgot I got him. That's for shit. Head over there. That? Oh yeah. There. Better? Much better. If it were for Fort Garnick, we'd all be speaking separatists right now. Oh, I forgot about this these guys. The right. Let's pick people. these up because Let's keep this quick and quiet, shall we? Psst. Strategic Information Service, former senator, one time governor of Dantooine. You do confidential work, don't you? You've probably heard about the separatist base up in the volcano. Well, the Republic needs someone to do some work there, confidentially. I might be able to do something. Good, good. Like I said, I represent the Republic here on Ord Mantell, and an item has come up that I think you can help us with. But it will require you to break into the Separatist base and take out their toughest guards. I'll do my part. Very good. Very, very good. Let me stress that this is a very sensitive matter. 
The Republic promised protection to a pirate a few months back, a pirate with whom we share common enemies. Recently, those enemies, the Separatists, captured that pirate and are holding him at their base. We need someone to free him. Why does the Republic want to free a pirate? I know, I know better to lock them up and throw away the key, right? Wrong. This pirate knows enough to end this war, at least on Ord Mantell. This pirate approached us with information on the Separatists and their operations in exchange for protection from the same. His relationship with them went sour, see? But the Separatists got to him before we did. The Republic promised protection. I'm asking you to keep that promise by breaking him out. Can you do it? It's tempting, but pirates tend to cut into my profits. Well, I hope you will decide in our favor. It will be a great service to the Republic, and, I might add, the reward is quite handsome. Go speak to my man at the entrance to the fort, Lieutenant Bendik. He'll fill you in on the details. I don't like pirates either, buddy. Freelancer, I hear you've been mucking up the Separatist plans. Don't know what your investment in this war is, but we need all the help we can get. This Separatist business on Ord Mantell has gone on long enough, don't you think? You can't walk two paces on this planet without getting shot at. Can't say I'd recommend anyone doing business here, no matter how tough. My boys could use some support out at the Sep stronghold, trying to secure the landing area so we can bring more troops in. But resistance is heavy and they're taking a beating. You're not under my command, but I'd appreciate if you report to Sergeant Vandal and lend a hand. Let me handle that for you. Good to hear. Like I said, Sergeant Vandal's running the mission. I'll let the beach camp know you're coming. And let's talk to Bendik. You know, I want to giggle at that name, but I also don't want to. <laughs> uh. Ah, great. So that blasted bureaucrat Milo finally found someone naive enough to want to free that damn pirate Veeam set. He said you'd give me the details. Yeah, that's my job. Doesn't mean I like it. And it doesn't mean I won't try to persuade you otherwise. Veeam set is filth. Bloodthirsty, ruthless filth. And he's a war criminal. His ships have been screwing up Republic supply routes for years. Countless people have died because of him. He took out my brother's battle cruiser, killed thousands more. The Republic should be planning his head on a stake, not offering him protection. If he can help us crush the Separatists, he's worth sparing. You want to crush the Separatists? Don't let no count criminals get away with running guns for them and shooting down Republic ships. The Republic knows this is a difficult mission. They won't be surprised if there's a little slip, a little accident. And since, you know, I'm in charge of payroll here, I could throw in a nice, healthy sum to sweeten the deal. If you, say, accidentally killed this pirate. So you're gonna kill him or what? You know what? Since we're a smuggler and pirates cut into our profits, as our friends so nicely put it. This galaxy could use one less pirate. You're damn right. And the Republic could use one less enemy. The pirate's being kept in the holding cell in the Separatist's base. You'll have to figure out the rest. I get the feeling you'll know what to do when you get there. Good luck. I'm gonna sell some of the stuff that I do have, so I have in Anything space. Anything Soldier needs, some things he doesn't. Good luck out there. Right, first off, we need to go back to Ardem. Tell the dude that we've got in his door. Reminder, recognized travel is for official business only. Sir, we saved your daughter. She should be back. Thank you. Thank you. You saved my daughter. Everyone, this is the good person who saved my daughter. She called to tell me what you've done and how grateful she is. I, I, I can't thank you enough. Not a problem. You're very gracious. Thank you. Oh, pants. Hell yeah. And a level up to boot. That ought to fix you. Alright, how far are we going? Oh yeah, I can just as well grab the fat gravel. Captain Vandal, 
Captain Zuss send you? Huh. I was expecting someone a little more official. Hope that blaster's not just for show. We got the Sep stronghold in our sights. Orders are to secure a landing pad and establish a secondary insertion point for the assault. I need you to shut down the security fields around the landing pad, and then disable the defense guns so our troop shuttles can land. Can you handle it? A few security systems, a few guns. What's there to handle? Uh, I got an uneasy feeling. The Separatists shouldn't have been able to hold out this long. I'll radio the shuttle so they're ready to move in the second you get the landing pad clear. Report back to the captain when you're done. Time to go fuck up a stronghold. The bases are always interesting, but they're always the same. So it, it's kind of sucky. But we're here for the story anyway, so it's fine. One of fifty. I thought I would actually get something. Sometimes they drop decent items. Especially early game, it can help. Damn, I wanted to electrocute them. That mission done? Uh, I gotta remember where the fuck is the other dude? Okay, yeah, we gotta go through the floor. I thought this would be better. Oh well.
part two of getting the landing bay. Time to talk to the pirates. Tutipuna pona, manchi kabok non ni slemo. You've got a funny way of saying thanks. Liska chanaga ima che choran chike. Katulia da pota twenty one ki slimo payukta changa. Considering he's a pirate, considering I'm a smuggler, there's history there. I'm killing you right here and now. <laughs> I like how Corso doesn't say a fucking word about it. He's just completely silent. Good. Suits me. Right, next part of clear not that landing bay. This might be a little bit hit. We did our job to the Republic. Nice. Now let's find out about Skavik. Get our fucking ship back. Alright, so random tip for anyone that doesn't want to uh, like, wait forever to be able to sell junk items, you can send your companion to do that. Pressing N, have your crew sell the low quality items in your inventory, you press that, off they go. See ya. And they will be back in a minute.
since we're here, we can do the separatist arm dealer thing. Get it out of the way. Last one down. criminal vermin how dare you invade my fortress and murder my courageous brothers in arms your pal Skavik stole my freighter I want it back there's no ship here for you only death you are guilty of crimes against the oppressed people of Ord Mantell the sentence is death memorize our faces well you criminal filth for we are your righteous executioners do you have any last words degenerate swine These won't be my last words. Let justice be served. Well, that was anticlimactic. I surrender. I surrender! Please! I don't want to die! I know why you're here, and you're wasting your time! I'm here for Skavik and my starship. Where are they? Skavik is long gone. He left here hours ago. Tirig was stupid to fight you. He got everyone killed, when he should have just told you the truth. Skavik showed up a few hours ago to deliver the guns, but it was all a trick. He pretended to be on our side so he could steal some rusty antique droid from Derek. Skavik came here to steal a droid? Some worthless pile of scrap that had been in Derek's family for generations. That droid was ancient. It's practically useless. But Skavik grabbed it like some big treasure and blasted his way out. He left in your ship. I don't know where he went, but I can guess who does. Skavik has a girl at Fort Garnick named Cyrena. You'll forgive me if I don't take your word for it. It's true! Derek talked to her on the hollow all the time with messages for Skavik. She was our main contact. It was Cyrena who warned us you were coming. If you want to find out where Skavik went, Cyrena's the one who knows. Please, let me go. I have a family back on the mainland. Please. Separatist scum killed my family, and I promised myself I'd bury every last one of you. I, I've only been here a few months. I didn't kill anyone's family. I only ever followed orders. Then I order you to die. Are you sure about this, Corso? The man seems sincere. Sincerity has nothing to do with it. Every one of these motherless scum deserves death. I can't just let him go home and pretend like nothing ever happened. He could be useful if he switches sides. Please, I swear to you, I'll never serve a man like Derek again. I'll just go home and take care of my family. Get out of here before I change my mind. Thank you. Come on, Captain. We need to have a little heart to heart with Sirena. Oh, yeah. And this is a convenient little thing. I don't know how long this has been in the game, but goddamn, when I found out about this, I was so happy. Where it is, you secured the landing area. Good work. War's never pretty, but I want you to know you're a real hero. It's important to remember we're fighting for peace on Ward Mantell. It's an honor to fight for the Republic. It's an honor to have you on our side. Thank you for your efforts. Hopefully this fight's almost done. 
The guild invitations, man. But hey, got some new boots. And a nice juicy right. little level up. I'll take it. Oh yeah, Bendik. <laughs> I heard our pirate friend had a little accident trying to escape the Separatist's base. Our pal Phipps' face turned purple when he heard the news. Brilliant. Brilliant work there. As soon as I met the guy, I said to myself, this can only end one way. Well, I'm glad it did. Here's your reward. Consider it fair compensation for your service to the Republic. And remember, this is our little secret. Ooh, ooh. Get some gloves, too. I'm not a fan of the color, though. But, that's fine. Let's go talk to Serena and then Vidu. I'm fine. God damn, this is all a mess. You fried Vito, sweetheart. So what if he called you talking to Separatists? He threatened to turn me into Rogan the Butcher. I had to kill him. Besides, now we can finally be together. Yeah. And the thing is, my cargo hold is full and you know, I'm busy with work. I'll call you sometime, though. I promise. What are you talking about? You promised to get me out of here. I've done everything for you, Skavik. You did it for the money. Same as me. The only difference is... You're not actually getting paid. I'll see you around, darling. Captain, I... I didn't see you come in. It's wonderful you're still alive. How long have you been back? Your friends in the secret base ratted you out. I should have known those halfwits wouldn't kill you. No use pretending, then. Skavik used me just like he did everyone else. That man could charm the armor off a of Mandalorian. Rogan the Butcher's bounty hunters are on their way right now. We don't want to be here when they arrive. Skavik took your ship and the guns to Coruscant. If you go now, he won't know you're coming for him. What kind of scam is Skavik pulling on Coruscant? He wouldn't tell me. It's something big, though. The Separatists are retreating from this island, thanks to you. And the Republic just reopened the shuttle port. I'll give you a shuttle pass to Coruscant if you let me disappear. Do we have a deal? Oh, well, she's got us there. As long as I get a haul jets out of here, fine. Good. Then I'll be on my way. I'd say it's been a pleasure, but I hate to lie. When you find Skavik, go easy on him. He's a two-timing liar, but it would be nice to see him again someday. Nah, his ass is getting fraught. Glad that ended peacefully. I'm not one to hurt women. No good would have come of it. I'm not letting her off for killing Vidu. I'll spread the word about what she did. Poor old Vidu. I wish she could hear what we did. Would have put a smile on his face. It's not healthy for us to stick around, Captain. I believe what Sirena said about bounty hunters coming. We don't know how long Skavik will stay on Coruscant either. Let's hop a shuttle and catch him while we can. I'm not one for causes, but I'm on board for that one. Vidu left me some stuff. I expect he'd want me to share it with you. Let's head for the shuttle board. We'll be off this planet before you know it. Ooh. Another upgrade. Fuck yeah. Let's start getting out of here. While we can. I knew it wasn't gonna be easy. Please tell me we get out of here. Anguas nimni mata sunri ni po papo cha wila pi. I'm sick of being cooped up on starships, Zoru. I want to run around and shoot things for a while. Bis gamayo kojedwanti. Noah, 
I'll be sure to call Rogan sometime. Tell him I said hello. Chut chut. Pochako la chano gando do waletapa. Bis gamayo kojedwanti. Noa huya ya chavopa. You guys want a thief named Skavik, not me. Ya tu kapo kafu krida. Vota mo krita chai chai. Oto nuava di kona i tuta od mishka punda. Sorry, I only travel first class. Joto pa, slimo gusha skorni. Jumping wampa lahagwa, jekoska umpasa do biska. But I'm glad you didn't. Get out of the picture. So much for the bounty hunters. Yes, we take a different path. Kind of weird it makes you go that way. Oh well. And this is where we stop our adventure for today. Thank you. So much for being here. I appreciate the hell out of you for watching this. This is, is like I said, this is something new. And I'm kind of enjoying my time with this. So I hope you guys are having fun as well. Please do take care of yourselves. People want you to be happy and healthy. Loved. If you're not feeling that way. I'm sorry. I hope that you can find someone that can help you out. Have an egg for you. There are professionals. It's never. And it's not weak to get help. But anyway, if you want to find out what I'm doing or where I am, you can find me on Twitter. I still refuse to call it X. All my social links will be below. You can find me on Twitch at warden underscore Artemis, as always. Also, I do bit shoot <laughs> where the less than savory videos go. So if you want those, all of my links are going to be below check them out but for now please do take care of yourselves and i'll see you all next time